Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome Cross Watchers. I'm going to take a look at your connection with you and your person. Remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with everybody. If you'd like a personal reading, I'll leave that information down below. So, what is passing? Cancer. We have heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving, mourning. What is this person's energy towards Cancer? Abundance. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. What is... Oh, there. We have healthy choices in your energy. Making healthy choices in love and in life. Self-love, self-care, being happier. And the external factors is the butterfly. Relationship evolving to the next phase. Healing the inner child and growth. What is the outcome? Karmic relationship, feeling, fleeting triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go and, let, and loving you. So someone someone hurt you, somebody broke your heart, or you're feeling like you've lost out, you've lost somebody that you really cared about in your past, or this could be something that you're kind of going through right now, and now you're starting to make better choices in people uh, i'm seeing that in the past somebody has been feeling stuck in a situation that was causing pain and that was causing a lot of mental insecurity and it was it was uh painful but i'm seeing that you are just fine it says everything is fine so you are kind of going through the motions or you've already went through these motions and you're starting to see the light. Yeah, so there was a lot of instability, competition or uh, disagreements, arguments, fighting, bickering, going back and forth. And it kind of left you feeling insecure in a way or just upset but you've been stuck in this in the past but i'm seeing that now you are um starting to whether you realize it or not get unstuck so this person here knight of cups they this person loves you a lot they have a lot of big big deep feelings for you and they want to send you a message a proposal here an apology for hurting you and hoping that you're going to take a chance on them but they know that you might not exactly want to open up your heart here but they definitely know exactly what part they played in this and they want to give you a genuine apology and give you an offer or an uh, something that can indicate a, a new start and the end of something that was that was painful for the both of you because again they they really 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 care about you and they want to fix things they want to start over and and take a chance um, whether you're going to accept it or not, they're wanting to take that chance and come forward and message you. A lot of water here. So you and this person could probably, possibly both be water signs or I'm also seeing Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But right now, I'm seeing that you're in a place where you are wanting to take things slow because you want to make sure that your heart is going to be in good hands. And... You're making better choices for yourself in love and you're starting to communicate. You're starting to heal mentally, I'm also getting, and really find your, your grounding. You're starting to get more grounded with yourself and starting to really nurture 
yourself and making yourself a priority and better choices for yourself so i'm seeing that you're really maturing you're really in a place that you're starting to mature and you're planning you're planning exactly what's going to get you to where you want to be and how you're going to protect your heart and your finances your your investment your effort and time so that's really what you're wanting to protect you don't want to waste your time here so there's an epiphany that you're getting you're getting a lot of clarity in a situation you're starting to awaken and become more aware of what needs to what needs to happen in order for movement to to go on so things have been kind of at a stalemate tell me about the butterfly justice so libra i'm getting that there's a decision that somebody's going to have to make weighing out the pros and the cons and there's a decision that is going to happen so this is could this can be a reconciliation or just making that decision to take things to the next level relationship is evolving to the next phase and that's what i'm getting here i'm also getting that there's a lesson that's being learned there's karmic justice that's happening here and um yeah so karma is 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 what you're not really aware of what you put in is what you get out what goes around is that even the saying what, what goes up must come down i don't know but i think you know what i mean <laughs> i think you know what i mean um yes i'm seeing movement i'm seeing movement towards a new beginning and really healing a situation that needs to needs to pro start progressing needs to really transform to the next level so i'm seeing that karma is coming in and there's some sort of karmic reward in a situation with this person so getting what um getting an apology or just getting what you've been need needing the relationship is evolving into the next phase so there's growth happening here. Tell me about karmic relationship. The sun. So this can be a karmic relationship. In your outcome though, I see that you're going to be really, really happy. Um, I'm seeing that there's a lot of self-love that you're putting into yourself as well. And finally turning into that person maturing into somebody who knows how to make themselves a priority and i'm seeing that this karmic lesson is is coming to an end so this burdensome cycle and healing and just putting in too much energy over investing or just putting in so much work and not really think not things not really being balanced is coming to a completion it's coming to an end and it's going to make you really happy so the things that this person has been triggering um in you in the past or resentments it's all coming to an end because you're 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 starting to make healthy choices in yourself and also this person is is maturing as well at the same time this could be a young male or somebody who has a sports car um yeah so your person's energy is spiritual growth so they're growing they're maturing and they're trying to keep a positive mindset you are i feel like you're open to some to like small talk or you're open to like a conversation about things but you're also not listening to outside sources or what people have to tell you. You're just more listening to yourself because you're really intuitive and you're you're paying attention to what what you feel. Um, this could be something that is long distance. There could be distance between you guys. 
we have Ice Queen. So I'm seeing that these changes, you should be seeing it sometime in the, in the winter if this applies to you. I'm also seeing that there is um, a feminine figure who has gained a lot of wisdom and really matured. Okay. Let's see. Is there anything else that we should know? Ask your angels. So, yeah, you're listening to yourself or your higher self, your guides, and instead of, like, gossip or people around you, what they have to say. And there's romance in your outcome. Getting closer to um, this person. So, also, one more thing that I need to add is that I'm also seeing that there is somebody new coming into your life, which could be a fire sign, could be a Leo. Okay, so that's what I'm getting for you. If you like this reading, please comment, like, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated, and I hope that you found guidance and clarity in your situation. Thank you for watching. Bye.